right, I moved it out of the garage. We're gonna try to see what this looks like with these claws here. Oops, scoot that back. Now, kitty, I fed you. What you want? You gonna help me paint? Georgia cat, you gonna help me paint? Okay, here's the cloth. I just pull one out. Let's see what this is gonna look like. Maybe kind of like a, uh, you know, roughing it up a little bit. Really pretty chocolate mahogany colors. Very nice. I don't want to get my head in the way of the camera like I do some of my other paints. And this is a stain, so also like if this doesn't look right, it doesn't turn out, I can always paint over it or hydro dip it or whatever I want to do to it. But so far, I'm liking it. I like the dark chocolate. It'll look great in this country western bar that it belongs in. And I got plenty of wipes. I do like the terracotta color showing through, but I don't like it, the streaks. So I should have a, uh, a paper towel maybe to wipe it and I don't have anyone to help me right now, so I have to, to keep going. <laughs> so I can't call on anyone to help me grab a paper towel or anything, so. All right, let's just rub him like he has a headache. There we go. <laughs> and I just knocked a part of that off there. Ugh, oh, these things are so brittle, you guys. You gotta be careful, but that's what Gorilla Glue's for, and wood glue and E6000 is one of my favorite kind of glues. They'll fix and glue anything. <laughs> I know I don't want to keep you watching the, me do this whole thing. That could be long and boring for you. But I do like actually like those lines coming down the middle because they're kind of curvy like that. Looks kind of neat if I do it curvy around the eye. That's kind of cool. The dark line in the middle. Go around his eye like that. It's cool, you guys. When that dries, I'll do the inside of his eyes and the underside of things. I'm kind of liking the way this is turning out. But I want to grab a paper towel, and I'm looking around where I'm at out here in the garage. I don't know if I have one. I think I see one. Let me go get one and see what it'll look like with paper towel wipe. Because I can always give it a second coat. I do have to fix some stuff there. Yeah, I see you. Little pieces chipped here and there. Okay. Let's see here. That's nice. He's old, you guys. Big old bull, huh? <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and stop the camera and rub this, the rest of this on here and do the back side and then uh, check in with you guys. All right. Okay, so what I've done now is I've turned the bull over and um, did finish some of that staining with the stain cloth. That stuff works really good, but I had a hole in my glove and it's all over my fingers and that stuff's really hard to get out because it's stained, but uh, I'll get it out. So anyway, what I did was after I flipped it over, I spray painted the teeth. Well, first I glued the teeth in with um, some super glue because they were really loose. And then I... Uh, I had spray painted for a base coat and put a piece of cardboard right here and then just kind of spray painted them like a cream color just to get some of that real hard looking gook off this poor bull's mouth, <laughs> his teeth and that. And then um, what I'm going to do is uh, when it dries, I'll go ahead and do this. Um, I have this paint here, the Beachcomber Beige, and it matches the teeth perfectly and I'll go over it so that way uh, it looks like a 
a really nice uh, mouth <laughs> and it get some of that stuff off there and it'll be looking good from a distance anyway and so after I flipped them over what I've decided to do since the back you don't see anyway after I use the stain I use some of this uh, stone textured finish and uh, in rust-oleum and it's kind of cool it's got a little terracotta color in it and that so it kind of matches the browns and the chocolates that I have in here and this is the back side so I'm gonna go ahead and finish the teeth and flip them over and uh, show you what we're gonna do next. All right, everyone, I finished him up. He's looking good. I flipped him around, I stained him, I painted him, I fixed his teeth. I had to paint those, got so bad. <laughs> Put a little turquoise design on him and some gold shimmer. He's a little two-tonish. He's looking good, y'all. It's still just a little bit wet, but sorry about the camera view. I'm outside in the sun. I can't see. <laughs> All right. There he is, everybody. Mr. Bull. Mr. Bull. Thank you for watching.